Hello everybody, Swaminath here. Today we are going to see SAP implementation interview questions and answers. Module is SAP SD, SD for the SD module. The first question they may ask you in the interview question is, what is organizational structure? So how to create the organizational structure? I have given the link, you can check that. The link has been provided in the description, you can check it, okay? So, Organizational structure we created in SPRO, SPRO, SAP Reference IMG, Enterprise Structure, Definition, Financial Account. This company, defined company, company code will be created by the finance, finance FICO consultant. Credit control area was also created by FICO consultant. And the link has been provided in the Description, just check the link. How to create the enterprise structure. They call it as enterprise structure or organizational structure or ORG structure. Okay, now then logistics general. Plant will be created by MM consultant, material management consultant. Division, define, copy, delete, check division will be created by sales and distribution. Minimizes sales and distribution. Define sales organization, define, define copy detention distribution chain. will be created by sales and distribution. And then material management. Storage location will be maintained storage location. Storage location will be inside the plant. That will be created by material management. Again, minimizes logistics general. Shipping point. Define copy detention shipping. This will be created by sales and distribution. Okay. So these things they may ask you in the interview. And then we have to do the assignments. Assignments. In the sales and distribution. Sales organization to company code. Assign distribution channel to sales organization. Assign division to sales organization. Set up sales area. Sales area is nothing but sales organization, distribution channel and division. And the shipping point will be created by SD concept, sales and distribution concept. And the finally, shipping point determination will be done by will be done by SD concept slash and OBL2. OBL2. They may ask you shipping condition from where the shipping condition comes from. The shipping condition comes from customer master. Loading group comes from material master and the plant and proposed shipping, which we have created. So we have to assign. This also they may ask you, OBL2. Transaction code is OBL2. This is the transaction code, OBL2. Let's go to the next slide. Go to the next slide. This is very, very utmost important. It's been given in the description. Create sales document. So how to create the sales document time, which has been given in the description. Just check the description. The link is provided in the description. All these five transaction codes we have to do. VOB8, VOB7, VOB6, VOB5, VOB4. They may ask you how, how would you create sales document type. Let's go to VOB8 first. Come back. VOB8. Here we create the sales, sales order type. According to the business we create. Okay, now we will be seven. We will be seven. Okay, item category, maintain item category. Whether the material is deliverable material or non-deliverable material will be determined by the item category. Whether the material is being relevant for pricing will be determined by item category. It's been given clearly in the description below. The link is provider, just check the link. VOB 5, 6, sorry, VOB 6. Next, VOB 6. Schedule lines category. Schedule lines category is nothing but confirmed quantity against confirmed delivery date. That is schedule line. Date. Whether the material is being, can be delivered on the confirmed date against the confirmed quantity. So this also we have to create. And then VOB5. 
vivo b5 assign schedule lines category to item category we have to do it <laughs> finally vivo b4 vivo b4 assign item category with the sales document okay sales document this is sales document so all these transaction codes we have to do it for the creation of the sales document you can check in the link provided in the description next slide let's go to the next slide assign sales area to sales document they may ask you in the interview interview question okay oba 10 either oba 10 go to oba 10 or go to spro spro sap reference img go to sales and distribution sales and distribution sales sales document sales document header assign sales area to sales document type assign sales document type permitted to for sales area what is sales area sales organization distribution channel and division it needs to be assigned to the sales document that is what it is okay this is the place where we assign the sales document type to sales area now let's go to the either you can go to the spro settings or oba 10 transaction oba 10 one zero let's go to the next slide master data configuration master data configuration so the first is customer master here sales and distribution is customer master customer master link has been provided in the description just check the, check that it's very very important utmost important it's utmost important they may ask you in the interview so all these configurations they, they'll ask you financial functional consultants main uh, main uh, roles and responsibility is configurations in the spro settings spro and material master that is also provided in the link just check it this is also very very important oms2 transaction code is oms2 for creation of the material type let's go to material type oms2 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 Here you create the material types. So you can use the existing one, copy as. Select the existing one, copy as. You can do that. Okay. Now let's come back. So these are all the interview questions they may ask you. Next, pricing procedure. Very, very important. This is also the link has been provided in the description. Just check that. So let's have a bird's eye view of this. Okay. So they may ask you what are all the steps involved in pricing, pricing procedure, condition table, access sequence, condition type, pricing procedure, pricing procedure determination, finally condition report creation. So these are all the steps you have to tell them in the interview. And these are all the steps we have to do it in the configuration side. This is purely configuration. So let's, I'll just show you the bird's eye view of it. Let's go to Vivo K0. Vivo K0. Here you create the condition table, access sequence. Condition table, access sequence, environment condition table, create. Condition table. Here you create condition table. Come back. Condition type, access sequence. Condition type. Define condition type. Pricing procedure. Pricing procedure. And then there are two more steps, document pricing procedure and customer pricing procedure. Document pricing procedure and customer pricing procedure. Pricing procedure, customer pricing procedure. Pricing procedure. For example, customer, that is each customer we need a separate pricing procedure. So for that, we can create a pricing procedure. Separate pricing procedure for the customer A. So another pricing procedure for customer B. So that is customer pricing. Document pricing procedure is 
each and every document we need a separate pricing procedure if they if the business is asking for each and every document we need a separate uh, document separate pricing procedure for a document then we can create a document pricing finally pricing procedure determination and condition report creation all this they may ask you in the interview so these are all the interview questions on implementation sap implementation next is cutover activity this is also the implementation questions in sap sd cutover activity see already i have given lots of uh, uh, video on cutover activity okay. let's discuss it again sandbox this is the sandbox golden box test client and production is the system landscape is the system landscape Okay, normally in the system landscape during the production, if you want to upload any any sorts of master records like customer master, material master, customer material info record, all this we can upload it in production server. So during the upload of the production, during the upload of the data in the production client, the master records, we just put off the production. So wherein no transaction will be allowed during that time, during the upload of the data. When we are uploading any data in the production, the production system will be halted and all the data will be uploaded and then production system will be revived. So that is cut over it. That is cut, cut over it. That is cut over it. Next slide. This is very, very important credit management. So wherein we create credit control area. Already I have shown you where to create credit control area. Here it is. You can create a credit control area. Definition, enterprise section, structure, definition, financial accounting, credit control area. See here, defined credit control area. So it is actually customer's credit limit. Limiting the customer. For example, if a customer A, Customer A and customer A is being given only 1 lakh rupees. He'll be able to buy only till 1 lakh. If he's going beyond 1 lakh, system will not allow. So the credit control area has been assigned to more than one company code. Because when the customer A is being uh, purchased a material from, from credit control from the company code A, he will not be allowed to buy it from com company code B. Okay. Because it has been assigned to credit control area. Both the company code A and company code B is assigned to credit control area. So that the customer will not be able to buy from more than one company code. Will after that, beyond the credit, beyond the credit, you will not be able to buy it. That is credit crunch. And the link has been provided in, this, in the description. Just check it. This is very, very important concept in uh, sales and distribution. It is integration with FICO also. Integration, FICO. SD integration, FICO, sales and distribution integration, finance controlling and sales and distribution, very, very important. So these are all the major questions they may ask you in the interview. Implementation questions, all these are all implementation questions. Thank you.